Welcome back, everybody, to Mega Man Legends 2. This beat, we're actually on the ladder. Anyone questioning what happened last part? Good. <laughs> Anyway, time to go to space. You didn't give me enough time to appreciate Will's hat. You'll have more time. There's never enough time. Well, here we are. Mega Man, be careful. Please? No. I will. <laughs> that was... <laughs> That was a cutscene that existed. I'm not sure how what, how much of that is the cutscene and how much of that is the dub. <laughs> oh, by the way, fun. Oh, by the way, I need to clarify something on on what I was saying the last time while Mega Man moonwalks like this. <laughs> uh, I uh this whole time I was thinking that the actor of Mega Man was the same one as in Legends 1, just for some reason higher pitched. No, it's not. It's not the same guy as the first one. Because apparently his voice was too deep for the for for Mega Man. Oh. So they decide to go for one of the female actresses from the first game. If anyone's wondering which one, the the mayor character from the first game. <laughs> like, how old is Mega Man supposed to be? About 16-ish. And he still hasn't hit puberty. <laughs> yes. Also, I People want to- People are weirded out to... that Sora hasn't hit puberty by 14. Also, I want to men also I want to clarify what uh, what how Mega Man turned into a baby after after going on the coup, <laughs> trying to trying to blow up the, the the original moon colony, but failed to do so. Uh, the reason he was the the how he was a baby was he was not a baby back then. He was turned into one by 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 the system. And lost all of his memory. The only one keeping all of it, but he somehow expected this. Don't ask me why, Legends Free will tell us. Uh, uh well, where he, where he expected it and put his memory into data. And by this time, he has his memory now. So yeah, somehow the most important character of the Legend series is this. <laughs> what is it, Mega Man? <laughs> anyway, spaceship time. I don't remember her voice. I see, I see you made up your mind. Are you ready to go to Elysium? <laughs> Man, I remember Rex and Pyra had to go through this whole freaking world map to get there, and all I do is just take a shuttle. <laughs> while you were unconscious and kept asking if there was anything she could do. She looked desperate. She probably would have done anything. Anything I told her to. If she thought it would have helped to bring me back. I think I'm starting to see why they don't play Once music in these cutscenes. <laughs> most of the time. You should take good care of her. She really likes you. How are we doing, Gats? Engines are online. I have Gats merge with the shuttle pod to repair it. Master Trigger, hurry. Mr. Sarah will execute the carbon reinitialization program shortly. What are you waiting for? Get in! Yes, ma'am! Where did they get in? Uh, the door. All the way up there? Yes. Did Mega Man even jump that high? No. You know, I really like Roll and all the other carbons. I think they're worth preserving, even if it means destroying the system. While this unit has reservations about destroying the system, it will do its utmost to assist you. Uh, something tells me they <laughs> well, didn't get the sizing right. Oh, the never mind, there we go. <laughs> That's a lot better. My, it's been a long time since I've been here. Hasn't changed much, though. Well, this is it. 
I'd go with you if I could, but seeing as this isn't my own body, I'll stay here. I'll spot for you, though, so I'll be with you in spirit, if not in body. Miss Sarah is most likely in the library, which is inside the mother area. The library contains the genetic records of the humans who built the system. Normally, the mother area can be reached by going through the master room from the center area. However, the elevator that connects directly to the center area is stopped on an upper level. That means you, you're going to have to go through the defense area, then go around through the side area. There should be a refractor somewhere in the defense area that can be used to power the elevator. If you can get the elevator working, you can get to the center area from the shuttle bay directly. The layout of Elysium may, may confuse you. Use your internal navigation system. Once you reach the library, you should find Miss Sarah. What happens next is your decision. I'll do all I can to slow Sarah down. Good luck. So what we're supposed to do is we're supposed to go... You're really supposed to go... <laughs> go into the doors and you'll find it eventually. <laughs> so anyway, right. th anyway, that, that item we just picked up is the green eye. One of the, la one of the last things for one of the strongest special weapons of the game. So you know how we just took the shuttle here? Yeah. <laughs> Operation. It's like riding the train. It's like riding the train at the beginning of KH2. You have to talk to Donald Duck instead of going on the train. Huh. <laughs> I remember this because I got because I I tried to jump on the train like six different times instead of talking to Donald Duck. I finally got the message. So anyway, if you have the gr laser manual like and the green eye. Wait a second, Mega Man. I finished making Shining Laser. Let me know if you want to try it. And we never even found the blade the blade notes for the Z Saber after we actually did the quiz. Good job, us. Man, I wish I knew something about blades, Mega Man. So anyway, here's the Shining Laser. Oh, there's high-powered laser beams. However, it is garbage if you don't e if you don't p power it up. <laughs> you need a lot of money to power it up, though. Ninety thousand zenny. You need forty-five thousand zenny. You need ninety thousand zenny. So yeah, if you want to grind, uh, this is the greatest weapon of the game. This is the strongest weapon of the whole game, if you grind for it. Plays racing music running loud. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm not doing it. You don't need it fully powered up either, because it's like, well... Alright, I can't. There we go. This is the this is the weapon. It is very very strong. It also takes a butt truck of money to to power to to fully power it up. You want to know how much? So here's the. Do you want to know how much you need to power up? the shining laser to full capacity. Sure. <sighs> Nine million seven hundred thousand zenny. <laughs> I see. 
However, if you do it, it is by far the greatest weapon of the whole game. Like, literally, it will wreck through everything. And, by the way, a, about, about, about seven million of it is the final energy upgrade. Because that makes it infinite use. <laughs> So, so if you're pre if pretty much if you if you have this, just just hold the button, aim, fire. You've beaten the final boss. <laughs> so the fierce deity mask, got it. Pretty much. <laughs> it's like lock on, mash attack. You won. No, just hold. You don't even yeah, have to mass hold. Mass attack is just, I mean, the first duty mass is lock on mass attack. Which is not, which IMO is, if at most, the tiniest bit more difficult than holding the button. <laughs> if not, in a Hi, Mega Man! I can walk too! I forgot how far away from Terra Elysium is! Somebody mentioned the door to darkness? <laughs> Did somebody mention the door to defense area? Somebody I mentioned the- Mega Man. I know a lithium like the back of my hand. Yeah. So anyway, you have to get close to it, otherwise it won't activate. And it'll blow up, <laughs> once you destroy all four of its arms. Thanks for letting me know because I legitimately thought that I was just a laser in the wall. I did too for a second. That's why I stopped. So uh, here's your be one of the best places to grind if you aren't doing a trick, uh, doing doing a a enemy spawn trick in one of the one of the other caverns because you just keep getting these robots. Not racing is the best place to spawn. No, this is late game. Early game, it's racing. Late game, it's the it's probably one of these guys. Okay. Just do this for about eight hours, and you'll have enough for the shining laser. Because, yeah, the so is it a 100% speed run of this game? <laughs> I don't think they get all the upgrades. <laughs> okay. Man, good thing they can't get me up here. Great, you assholes are back! My favorite! Mind her that these only just slow you down. God, 
I hate those enemies so much. Yes, I know I'm slow. Remind me to not walk <laughs> like that anymore. <laughs> Just wait until they're done. Oh, hi. Yes, Mega Man, the one over there is the greatest threat. All it does is make your jump jump lower. Give me health, please. Of course not. They drop health all the time when I'm not at low health, but when I am at low health, never! Eh, good old Mega Man. That's a thousand, probably. It's either, I'd say, 99% chance it's a fallacy, 1% chance it is bad game design. <laughs> as a bubble would against me. Besides the knockback, which is hilarious when it does less than, 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 than like 50th of my health. 
Why won't you die? Thank you. We yield with the healthy power of healthy health. Gravity can be controlled. 80% of power. If you lower the relative gravity, you'll be able to jump higher than normal. If you increase the You already knew that, didn't you? Use that control panel to download information about Elysium. Download control panel data. And now we jump like the water area, but move like normal. Yay! By the way, most, pretty much every item that's not the, that's not here now will, is just the, is just money now. Pretty much every uh, item apart from the green eye in here is money drops. Which means if you if you don't have the stuff for roll, uh, you missed it. <laughs> Do I care? Not really. I have a shining laser. <laughs> but you could get the Zet Saber. Yes, the the short range weapon, which sucks. <laughs> Let me make sure that the... Oh, the shining laser does do stuff to them. Uh, while they're on the ground, they do the bubbles. Yay! Oh yeah, I just realized why the shining laser wasn't doing anything more the first time. Because the range on it is garbage right now. Which means the hitbox isn't doing much right now, is the reason. Open up the floor. What are you waiting for? Wait. <laughs> <laughs> uh. With the low, lower gravity, you can jump in here. Alright, there's also the actual, like, upgrade stuff. Like, buster part upgrades. What's that one? Attack energy rapid. Maximum energy. Yeah, I'll take that was fine. Now I shoot blue! Instead of that lemon! Means, that means it's unblockable, right? No. Blue lasers are unblockable. No. It's the case in Kingdom Hearts 3, so it must be the case in every game. Because Kingdom Hearts is the ultimate in gaming. And not related, no, Kingdom Hearts 2 is our favorite game. <laughs> Riverbot Defense Control System. Intruder detected. An intruder has been detected. Re reassigning all Riverbots, defensive systems, and materials. By the way, the Riverbots were created by in this place. <laughs> Makes sense. And then Sarah increases gravity in Mega Man's Trap for F. Mega Man! <laughs> Don't worry, Mega Man, I can get you out. I'm gonna ram it! <laughs> Roll them up! It's just a bus, just flying <laughs> through space. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds about right.
Oh, she breathing. Don't worry, Mega Man. My my newsboy cat makes it so he can breathe in the vacuum of space. I mean, how is Mega Man breathing? <laughs> and before you ask, no, he's not a robot in this ser in this version of the series. I think it's lava. Yes, it is. Perfect. That means I can walk through it no problem. Because of my asbestos. What? Are you okay, sir? Well... That's why I thought there were just no energy drops, because those enemies dropped them like candy! Man, good thing they can't get through a door. Way! Okay, get away from those so I don't accidentally get burned. I don't think I have the, en the enemy one. Enemy resisting fire stuff. To resist enemy fire. No, I don't mean shots. Taking fire and not the good kind. What is the good kind? Fire. So he'd rather be set on fire? Well, yeah, because he's held the album and his fire powers. Oh. Uh, okay. <laughs> It's another one of my many free and force references before we ever actually play free. <laughs> By the way, the bombs can land on you directly, so be careful of that. I assume it does more damage. No, it does the same damage, it just doesn't have the have the you need have the have the wait before it explodes thing happen. Uh, it just immediately explodes. <laughs> I um, noticed that they wait before they explode. Good job, go. <laughs> you do us proud. Okay. There's nothing in this room. It's very cool. There's only one going back there. I thought that was just for money and pain. Oh boy, more of these! More of the grind bots! Okay, probably want to kill more of the ground troops than I have, was doing. <laughs> See why these guys are a great source of money <laughs> at this point in the game? <laughs> and you can just leave these guys alive forever and they'll keep spawning more! It's like the Summers and Final on the Mechos. And then, the the actually, the and, then the, and then you just power up the energy and then you and then you just power up the energy and power of the shining laser, hold down the triangle, and get the one thing that, that magnetizes the Zenny to you. <laughs> I've done oh. it in an hour. Oh, so no, it's more so no, it's more like uh, It's more like the the strategy my dad found in Next Run Legends 2, the in the room where it infinitely spawns enemies. Yeah, uh, the most broken character in the, the most broken character in all of X Men Legends and Ultimate Alliance and Marvel Ultimate Alliance. I joke them together because they're more or less the same. They're, mechanically, they it, it's pretty obvious that uh, Ultimate Alliance is the spiritual successor to Ultimate Legends. <laughs> um. Don't ask why Iron Man is an X-Men Legends. I don't, I don't have any idea. Because it's Marvel. <laughs> but 
He's the only not X-Men character in there. Iron Man has nothing to do with X-Men other than being a, like a Marvel character. <laughs> Why Iron Man of all people? <laughs> anyway, Iron Man's super broken. He has this he has a he has like a repulsor raise attack where you just hold down the button and you just go <laughs> and that's This doesn't have a thing on there. It's evil! Well, actually, first you use uh, his actual most broken move, uh, motion amplifier, which for some reason costs basically nothing. Uh, it makes it so he his attack is his attack speed is increased by like 300 percent, and he does like triple damage, <laughs> and it costs basically nothing <laughs> to use. So you can basically just have it active all the time. And then you use your pulse rays and it starts going and it basically just melts anything in front of him. Problem is it also costs a stupid amount of energy. So you can only do it for like one second before he runs out of energy. But here's the thing, you can use Oh, destroying the enemies in that in that dead end room opens this door. Okay, that's the reason for that door. I was like, why where's the switch then? So anyway, my dad figured out you can use Jean Grey or Scarlet Witch, and they have a power that makes it so whenever you, uh, I think it's whenever you defeat an enemy, uh, you regain some energy, and it applies to the whole team. So you just activate that on Iron Man, and then you, uh, go to the, the you aim at the spot where the enemies infinitely spawn, which by the way, they instantaneously spawn. The instant you kill the previous enemy, it instantly spawns the next one. So you just aim at where they spawn, and you just hold down repulsion rays, and there's just a row of like 20 enemies collapsing on top of each other, non-stop. Huh. <laughs> and yeah, it's the fastest way to level up the whole game. Oh. <laughs> So if you're wondering why Iron, why Iron Man and Iron Man Scarlet Witch and Jean Grey are higher level than everybody else, now you know. <laughs> anyway, because of gravity being super, being 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 intense here, the doors are locked. <laughs> Thought increased gravity would open these, so I'm gonna check real quick. Oh, there we go. Yeah, the thing you also do with Iron Man you use, you use a different attack. You, you use motion amplifier, and then you use a different attack, where you shoot these, like, five, like, energy shots that bounce all out, that bounce off of things, like, four times each. You just do, you just do that, like, three times, you just go into a room, and then you just fire that, like, three times, and then everything's dead. It's really stupid. Right now, trying to get out. <laughs> there we go. You did it. There's the platform. You saved the world from the forces of thick headedness. Let's well, go see that other door and see if that opens. It does! Don't know if this is progression or not. Well, there are ceilings on the enemy. I mean, the enemies on the ceiling. Uh, it off the ceiling. <laughs> oh, great! <laughs> My favorite enemy to experience when I'm fighting other enemies. Got it. Jump forever. Understood. What about the bubbles? You 
move out 10,000 zenny and we're blinded by the light. Blinded by the light! Light! Why? You do it better than I do. Why? Why? Probably because it's one of my favorite lines of that whole game. But <laughs> why? Because it sounds so out of place with the rest of his dialogue. <laughs> And as we all know, I do high-pitched characters way better than ma than normal-pitched characters, which is why Joel does all the female voices. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Thank you, Bond! You saved me! <laughs> well, I can do those too. I suppose... That is the case. Hmm. So what do you think of the dungeon so far? It's... A dungeon. <laughs> yeah. Kinda. Uh, figuring out it's, what I it's haven't, a dungeon. Haven't been. Okay, go that way. Got it. Oh, I, yep. I think that kind of sums it up. It's a dungeon. I mean, compared to the last few we've got in this yeah. game, it's this a is dungeon. A big is, improvement. Unfo unfortunately, it's a dungeon is pretty good for this game. Well, mostly the the half, the second half of this game. Okay, it's a dungeon is par for this game <laughs> because there's a lot of bad ones. You can use that refractor later. And there's the refractor if you want the shortcut. Which you want, because do you really want to backtrack through all this? <laughs> oh no, I want you. Okay. More ring pop. Guardian. <laughs> Pop Duke Guardian, okay. Once you have max attack buster, these things go down really fast. I mean, that's probably the case for most of the game, but, you know. Especially so. And the side area. a side area. Well, it's the side area that's also a residential area. So why isn't it called the residential area instead of the side area? The door isn't working. The door isn't working. The door isn't working, Sora! God damn it! What? So anyway, the fun of this area... Here's how big this area is. Doors! Go through the doors. Your main goal is the center area. So is it just gas and truth? Is it just gas trial and error, or is there some way to tell where you're actually gonna go? Uh, checking that right now, actually. Yeah, 
Yes, the doors uh, the doors correlate to which platform you go to. Uh, you, sorry, you can't all work. not all of them work. So. Yeah, not all four doors work, so you gotta figure out which one works. <laughs> you gotta try every so island and figure out which one you go through. Six hundred dead end. Yeah, pretty much. So just figure out what door go what door brings you to the middle place. Make sure to always lock on, especially when you see the red thing go off, because most of the time you're going to be getting hit by something, because the enemies are very fast. Guys, don't, don't go that way. It's not correct. <laughs> that, that will take you up, and that's going to be a minute. Yeah, but what if there's treasure up there? Okay. Well, <laughs> okay. Sir, it's a video game. Well, I owe it. You always go the wrong way. Just in case there's something there. Oh, there's a door that isn't working. Congratulations. You never know. Also, it respawns the enemies so I can get more money. Maybe I'll get another upgrade for the laser before everything dies. <laughs> before I finish the game. Probably not, but, you know. Why am I doing that? Oh, yeah, quite a bit still. But yeah, even if you hit all the money chests throughout the whole game and all the money holes in the dungeons, uh, you still won't have enough. You still have to grind for the shining laser. Yeah, obviously. Unless there's a, unless there's a chest that just has like 8, 000, 8 million zen in it for some reason. I'm not surprised that they make you circle all the way around it and go in like that. I'll bet you probably spent a lot of your time there, didn't you? I don't know. I think she forgets that I don't ha have the memories of this place. Something all over there. Oh, this is the bump, the the shortcut one. Never mind. Even better. I mean, how are you? <laughs> I don't use the shining laser money yet. Need to go charge up first. And the fastest way is make sulfur bottom ship a shop. Cause that's the closest one. So more classical music. <laughs> Okay. 
Could you tell the king I'm really sorry? <laughs> What do you want to improve? They're finished. Okay, still a lot. So yeah, uh, the prices go up very, very quickly, by the way. <laughs> 450,000 semi to improve this. Do you want to improve it? Yeah, it goes up very quickly. <laughs> Omega, Omega, and Alpha. <laughs> How about no? By the way, for some ungod reason, they allow you to sell the stuff that's actually equipped to you. So, uh, be careful of that. <laughs> actually... Oh, never mind. I forgot to to equip the <laughs> equip the. <laughs> I've been I haven't even had the best armor <laughs> that whole time. I didn't even have the best armor that whole time. Huh. Sniper unit booster pack. One thing. Okay, never mind. No, they don't. <laughs> I was wrong. You were wrong. You were wrong about everything. Well, not everything. Everything! I don't think it's like that, sir. Every word you said is a lie! <laughs> Anyway, that should get me at least one other thing for the laser. Should at least get me range. Six thousand, sir. It's a lot more than that. That's uh, that's a lot of zeros. Nice that's way more zeros than you think it is. <laughs> By the way, those it's these one are more here. zero than I think it is. All right, so pretty much I'm not getting anything else from the laser. Like I don't think there's that the much. Laser has achieved its the highest potential it will. Yeah. Yes. So pretty much the rest of my body will be on canteen. Well, is it 2,000 or less? No. <laughs> well then, sorry, roll. Sorry, roll. It's like saving the world takes priority. Looks like Mega Man and I won't be able to see each other for a while. But I'm not scared. I know we'll see each other again soon. Good luck, Mega Man. 
notepads for when you head to, to there. I realize now that everything I've done up till now is because I had Mega Man by my side. I realize now how much I love him. I'm so happy I have him in my life. they really are trying to go for that role Mega Man ship. I mean, this is the only time in Mega Man Legends in the Mega Man series where they're not literally brother and sister. <laughs> Wait, no, there's also Mega Man.exe. <laughs> so never mind. Battle Network also ha doesn't... I think Battle Network also ships them, actually. I believe you had another thing in your text. What do you want to know? You do! So, next time on Mega Man Legends 2, we'll get these. 